YouTube family, it's your girl Love Kisses 99 and I'm coming to you today with a really quick haul video. I picked up a few things from both the Burlington, uh, they used to call it Burlington Coat Factory but now it's just Burlington, I don't really know what the rest of the name of it is and I picked up a few things from um, Forever 21 online because as you know Forever 21 does have a plus size line but they're available online and in the store in Times Square they're only available in a few of the brick and mortar stores you can find all of their plus size clothing in the on the website so first let me show you what I picked up from Baker's this bag is from Baker's this bag I had for a minute but the good thing about this bag is I found this in one of those clearance bins and I think this bag was like maybe 10 bucks but I thought it was great for a real cute pop of color I'm not sure if I showed this to you already but I don't think I did and then it has like the little two compartments on the side and then a zipper at the top and then there's one large zipper compartment on this side and then there's a holder like for a pen and for your cell phone or you know like a little something else your wallet or whatever right here and yeah this I think this bag was like maybe 10 bucks I don't think it's real leather but it looks like leather I'm gonna rock it like it's leather doesn't really matter the material to me so yeah always check the clearance bins when you go into department stores especially bakers because usually they have a like clearance bin right up by the register so definitely check that out okay and this cute maxi dress I picked up from Burling and it has a little bit of braiding all the way around the top and I thought this dress was so absolutely adorable I like the colors in it you can rock this with really almost any color shoe but I thought this was so totally cute I picked this up then on to what I picked up from forever 21 online this skirt was $11.80 and it's a lace skirt and it has like the tan underskirt see here's the lace and then it has like a tan underskirt and I thought this skirt was so really really cute and I picked up two color block skirts now this one is I think this one was $15.80 but these items I was able to get on sale so this is just a color block skirt and here's the other color block skirt. I thought this was so cute and it kind of narrows in right above the knee so it doesn't kind of fall straight. It kind of hugs your curves a little bit and it gives you a little bit of accentuation around your curves. So that's the front. It just has a plain black back. Now this dress, now that I got it, I'm not really too sure about the color. But I think this dress was, I'm looking for the tag, actually I must have taken the tag off already. I don't think this dress was like maybe 10 bucks. But here it is. It has the natural ruching already in place so even if it moves the ruching stays put. And then it's just black, it has like a little black band and the black band kind of goes right under your breast. And then it has like a little zipper on the side. So yeah. And as you can see like on the sides where your hips are, it has a little natural curving right there to give it a good fit on your hips. So those are the items I picked up from Forever 21. Now on to my shoes from Baker's. These shoes I fell in love with. I, I, just, I, I just fell in love with these shoes when I saw them. Now this heel is a tiny bit higher than what I usually wear, but you know what? They're not for walk. These shoes are definitely not for walking around all day. These are for a date night or for even kind of going out to dinner, even a night out with the girls. But I don't know how long these would survive after a few hours. I gave them maybe three or four hours and I was good. But at like hour number four and a half, my tootsies were crying a little bit. But here they are. I have an awesome gold heel. And then they have the zipper in the back, which you just zip this on up when you put it on. And then it has the detailing in the front. Now this here is elastic, so you get a lot of play with this. So even if your feet swell a little bit, you're still good. And then the middle strap stays stationary and then the bottom strap is stationary. But here where you need it most, you have a little bit of extra give. 
So yeah, these are from Hal these are made by Halston. H by Halston and these are available at Baker's. And I think these were maybe $80. I don't really remember how much these were. And the name of the shoe is called Reagan. So yeah, this is Reagan, and I got a little bit of wear out of Reagan already, so definitely check out Baker's. Always check out their clearance bin. Always check their sale rack. Baker's always, always, always has some type of sale going on. They're usually available in your local mall, but also check online because they have a massive amount of shoes online. Now, also, usually when I wear heels like this, I pick up a pair of these non-slip little grips like this and here's the little diagram of where they go on your shoe right on the pad of your shoe so it keeps you from slipping so definitely if you wear heels often definitely pick these up if you're worried about like maybe like slipping and falling these give a lot of good grip and it's nice and hard and I'll take this pair out of the package so you can see it and what the surface looks like now this side is just the side you peel. You peel this off and put it on your shoe. But look at the texture on here. The texture is phenomenal to give you a little extra grip if you need it while you're walking in order to kind of keep you from hitting the pavement or hitting the ground. These work really well. So definitely check out the non-slip grips for the bottom of your shoes. Check out Forever 21 online. And people are really plus size is changing so a lot of stores are considering a 12 a plus size they're considering a 14 a plus size so I did notice with the clothing from forever 21 if you wear a typical 14 and most stores in forever 21 you're gonna have to go up a couple of sizes only because the measurements at Forever 21 are a little bit different. They're not particularly, in my opinion, standard, but you can definitely find something. Like, I'm technically like a 14 on the top and a tight little 14 on the bottom because of this caboose I'm dragging back here. But you can definitely find something in Forever 21. I suggest if you're a 14, get like maybe a 1x or a 2x because they're cut very differently they're not really in my opinion they're not really cut for super curvy girls if you have an ample bottom I suggest that you go up a little bit in size when you go to forever 21 and if you happen to be in an area that has a forever 21 plus section go in and try something on it never hurts to try something on just so you can gauge your size and just know lots of skirts are cut a little bit differently dresses everything's cut different pants are cut different than you know the skirts than the dresses something you might be able to wear a 14 in as far as a pair of pants you might have to go up a little bit in a dress or a skirt because of your curves so when you have an opportunity definitely check out Baker's Forever 21 online and also if you have a Burlington it used to be Burlington Coat Factory check it out they have some awesome buys they had everything in my opinion they're a lot like a Marshalls but with a lot more stuff so definitely check them out when you have an opportunity that's just my quick haul video and if you'd like to see me do some outfits of the day or something like that please leave a comment because I don't normally do those but if you'd like to see them I'll be more than happy to do them so that's pretty much it for right now and I'm hoping you have an absolutely awesome day today and I'll see you again soon bye